Welcome back to another video. My name is Thomas Gelder. So in today's video, we're going to learn how to do the setting your hands on fire effect. So this is a pretty simple effect. All you've got to do is get a shot of you doing that, either with your thumb, or you can just do that with your hands. And then what you want to do then is get some green screen footage off YouTube that is free to download. But make sure the fire looks realistic and make sure it's, it's the fire that you can incorporate with your hands. So then you're bringing it into the editing suite, get the clip, get the fire green screen clip on top of the other clip. And what you want to do is you want to go on ultra key, key out the green screen, bring the fire into position in where the hand is. So make sure you're right at the start of the clip so you're not missing anything. Position it where it needs to be, key it, make sure you put the opacity on screen on the fire clip, and this makes it look more realistic. And then what you want to do is just follow the hand frame by frame. Now, once you've done this, make sure you watch back the clip and make sure the framing and the keying is done correctly. Once you are satisfied, go to the end of the clip, and this is where you want to fade out the fire effect. So, what you want to do is you can either bring the opacity down, so make sure you key it at 100% bring it down to two or three frames and bring it down to zero. Or another way you can do it is just key it out so it looks a bit more realistic, like you're blowing out the actual fire. And by this I mean just key out the, f the flames bit by bit by each frame, if that makes sense. I'll show you an example of what I mean. And that's it, that's this effect done. It's a very simple and easy one. I didn't really want to go too in depth. I just want to keep giving you some snappy interesting ones that you can then go out and do it yourself on bigger projects that's it for this video i hope you enjoyed um make sure you hit the subscribe button and i'll see you guys next time